ready then? Yeah. Okay. Hi everyone. Hi. Welcome to Cozy Up Knits. I'm Sarah. I'm Jamie. Hi everyone. That's Jody is walking around here. Somewhere. Jojo just got home. She's around. We're a small crew. We're like, Sarah says back to the OG. Back to OG. Just don't go watch. back and watch OG. Do not videos. go back. Five <laughs> years ago. Five years ago, it started off with just Sarah and I. Or if you want a good chuckle. Maybe go awkward, back and watch like, a couple. Oh They're funny. It, we were super awkward. We were it really awkward. awkward. It was well, hard. The ladies at midnight had to convince us. Yeah. To do this. So yeah. Oh, there's Joe. We're gonna we're gonna pause and have a little bit of a snack break, but we thought we would pop in and show. Mom, what? Oh, I brought my. Oh. <laughs> so I tried my hand yesterday at sourdough. This is my first yeah. time. I well, say a seven out of ten. Oh no. It's edible. It's easily a four. No. <laughs> If it was a four, I wouldn't eat it. My other one had a really nice top, but we cut it off. So we it's oh a little dense. Time. We turned it into a snack, like a like a chip dip. Yeah. We and we pulled out it. all the bread inside. So we're going to have a little snack. This is our snack attack. I sourdough think snack attack. I'm going to go down the sourdough rabbit hole and give it a go. I have my starter and I think I'm going to yeah. try again. And I'm going to work out the kinks. Obviously the first time, I think. I still think that this is more than a four. It's Fine. just dense. That's the only oh, problem. Yeah. The taste is there. I know now. There. Like, I should have watched the YouTube videos before. Yeah. I did it, but our Hi, cousin was to here. Our sourdough podcast. Yeah, welcome to this is a knitting podcast, but um, I think knitting and baking go together. Yeah. Our, sure. our cousin was here who is an actual baker. Yeah. And he got us started with the sourdough starter and everything. So I'm going to give it a go. But we're going to have a little snack and we'll be back shortly. Okay, welcome back. Thanks for enduring our snack attack. I'm not quite ready. Um, but yes, knitting podcast, and we have some stuff to show because we missed last week, unfortunately. Yeah. Feels like it's been longer than yeah. It like does feel two full weeks. Well, it's we only missed one podcast. Yes. Yeah. 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 But it feels a long time when we're not here. So, mm -hmm. um, I didn't have anything last week. We've got week yeah, Kate, yeah. No, we didn't really have much knitting. No, I Katie, had the same and thing. And Katie's the, even this week has only been knitting her blanket. Her, a little bit on her blanket. But Mom will show you her blanket, which is nice. You'll get to see the blankets that they're doing. Mm -hmm. um, Chrissy is um, at home awaiting an arrival of puppies. Of multiple puppies. They will be coming anytime. Babies are moving. The mm -hmm. video she oh, sends, geez. like, Nina's belly is like... You know, we should I message her and 11. tell her to take a real video. Yeah, that would be fun. Because then she could send it to me and well, I could put it in. Oh, that would be fun. Yeah. That'd be fun. So we'll see if you get to see Nina, but... That's Christina St. Bernard, who's due any day. Yeah. Well, around the 9th. Yeah. Which is any day. Yeah. And then Kate's at home date? with her girls. We aren't feeling well yeah, today. Well, it's the 6th, I think. Kaylee keeps screaming in pain. She's got an earache. Yeah. It's a weird oh. earache. And I wonder if it also has, because I don't, if it also has to do with the weather. Yeah, the wind. She's like Auntie Sarah. It, it's been so windy. But that, that was the first thing I asked Katie. I said, were you guys outside? Mm -hmm. She said, hours before. I know. And it's, it's instant. Like, I can feel my earaches. Yeah, come on, I'm pretty instant way. out in the wind. Yeah, yeah, I have to, have, I have to have something covering my ears. Yeah, and I also Good thing we're usually have stuff shoved in my ears if it's windy. Headbands. Yeah, so this that's... is the worst time of the year for me because I want to be outside. It's nice and warm, yes. but it is quite windy but and it's still, it's still a little bit cool. It's yeah. cold still. Like it's still chilly. Today is cold. Yeah. The wind is cold. The sun yeah. is out, but that's your weather update since Katie's not here. Yeah, it's spring. It's spring. And it's yeah. melting, and then it's freezing, and melting, and freezing. Yeah. Okay, where do we want to start? Like, where do well, we want to start? Maybe oh, what we're wearing? Maybe I'll start with, start with what oh, we're wearing. Okay, start yeah. with what you're wearing. I'm wearing my weekender. The weekender that I made her. Yeah. Just kidding. That's it. I think I made three or four hey of Hey, guys, look what I'm not wearing. Right? Not uh, wearing a hat. And my hair is... It's greasy. It's greasy, but it's the greasy. way you have it parted looks really cute. Okay, and I don't even mean to part it like this. My part is usually not this drastic over this side. Yeah, but she's just the going... way I sleep, I must, like, whip my hair she's going all the way over like the that. The drastic part. And so I kind of, but I can't change it now because all this hair oh, yeah, no. stays to this it's side. Not moving. <laughs> so, yesterday we went to Costco and she had her toque. Yep. Her muckalucks on, and I. Yep. She's walking, and I was. It looks like you're should be on a ski slope. I actually. Oh, she she looks like I got capris on today. Oh, she does. She shaved her legs. I know. Yeah, I did. It's a big deal. It's a big deal. The, the springtime yeah. legs and feet and. 
I'm ready for shorts now. Things. It's like one day of capris and I'm ready for like hot shorts. Yeah. Well, we're not there yet. And my, um, the couple years ago when we had uh, grandma and grandpa's anniversary out at Chrissy's, mm -hmm. that year we had a really bright, sunny April and May and oh, we yes. were all so tan. But yeah. I look back at myself and I'm like, whoa. I know. And it was early. I we was had a hot, so hot May. dark. Yeah. And like even and Logan was so, was so tan. Oh, the paste. Yeah. Well... Okay. Anyways. Mom, you want to start? No, what are you wearing? Oh, I'm wearing, yeah. that's right. Um, this is called City Limits. It's City Limits sweater by Tannis Fiber Arts. It I was love one that I sweater. made a while back. It's a little bit short, of course, because I tend to knit too short. I get bored. But it's holding fingering double and just like busting your stash and yep. fading down. And it's a bunch of fingering skeins. Yeah. And I do like it. I love it. I would that actually sweater. knit another one and make it a little bigger. I'd like it a little bit a little roomier, longer. longer, and just bigger. I just feel like it's... Well, know. you can give me that one when you're done with it. <laughs> yeah, you know what? I could. I I'm totally joking. could. I do like if it, If it's though. short on you, it's going to be short on me. But I love this reverse, like, because it's reverse, and it's got this... I just like the way it's designed <laughs> with all the I-cord detail, because yeah. I love an I-cord. It's got an I-cord edging, and it's I the reverse stockinette or whatever. Yeah. Anywho. What are you wearing? Well, nothing. Oh. <laughs> well, Mom's wearing Finny. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> I have no Finny hair. Today. And uh, let's see this blanket, mom. Okay, I'll, I'll just pass it up for you guys. Okay, yeah, I'm loving these colors. So she's doing that feather and fan, same as Katie. It's a free pattern on um, patents. Sure, it's just pat Google. I think it's patents. Yeah, just Google free feather and fan and it'll pop up. Yeah, you can find lots of them online. It's one of the yarn companies' um, yeah. free patterns, like from their website. Look at this. She's the just colors are looking through. so good. It's like you're planning it, Mom. It looks so cool. Yeah, I'm not planning it. I just grabbed some. I just grabbed all this. You're holding fingering spare, double? Well, fingering, one fingering and maybe one DK. Just whatever you grab. Some, whatever. It's yeah. funny. I have a hard time telling to look better. When you do something like this and then you really see like the colorways that you're drawn to, even yep. if you're just grabbing random, it's like what was in your stash. Uh, yeah. Can sometimes tend to just blend anyways yep. because. But this pop of green, I'm loving this pop yep. of green and then you're yep. bringing it back in and some more green up here. Up I'm really top. liking yep. this, Mom. That's going to be nice. Oh, I want to pick my blanket up again. I'm so close. <coughs> I've, been, I've been working. Work knitting. Oh, my God. That's pretty much all I've been doing is just those. Yep. Well, that's a perfect... And I, I'm going to get another sock on the needle again because I don't have yeah. any socks on the needle. So. It's a little smaller project to bring her out. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You need a sock going. Yeah. yeah. Maybe we'll get you going on one here. Okay, I have a funny story. I want to talk about mail day. We'll get into it. Okay. The we'll talk about mail day. So, I get this... I won't show it because it's got addresses on it. Um, But I get, like, this mail. But, like, on the front, it's really just, like... I seen that it was from Grand Prairie and I was just looking, I was like, what is where we live? And I'm like touching it, and I'm like, what is in here? Anyway, so I pull it out and I laughed so hard. I've been getting Marcos from uh Debbie saying, Oh, you can't, you forgot your socks here, you forgot your socks here. She mailed, mailed me my dirty socks. <laughs> they're dirty. Oh Debbie no. as in Deb? Yes, yeah. Deb, Dad and Deb. Oh no, they are clean. <laughs> Did, Did she you wash them? them? Debbie, thank oh, you. Debbie, Let me see. That is hilarious. I don't think she washed them. No. I think they're dirty. You think they're dirty? You well, I wouldn't them. have washed them for you. Yeah, I know. But yeah, so she totally mailed me my socks. Thanks, Deb. That's really funny. I laughed so hard. And like one, only like one stamp. That's how much it costs yeah, to mail a pair stamp. of socks? Yeah. Perfect. That's cheap. I laughed so That's hard. That's cheaper than I was like, driving them over to your house, probably. I laughed so hard in the truck, I scared Logan. He's like, what? <gasps> Wait, what's funny, Mom? And I'm like, oh. It's so Your funny. Your funny. Yeah, she's a funny, funny duck. Mm -hmm. um, speaking of real mail day, though, we do have some goodies. They came in, of course, like right after last, like two weeks ago podcast. Right. I hate when mail does that. It comes like, I'm like, we could have shown it on the podcast. Which okay. is funny because it used to do that. Yes, at my other house. Even when we podcasted yeah. on Thursdays. Exactly. It didn't matter. And now it's Wednesday. So is this a cute sticker she had made? This is burlap handmade. This is Julie. Okay, look at her little, oh, like, cute. you gotta pull these out. So you need to go and get her on Instagram immediately. She's back at it. She's making some really fun little um, oh, wooden, wooden crafty things. So I want you oh to- Oh my gosh, look at these little sheep. Burlap and, no, burlap handmade. <laughs> Not here, and handmade. Look at this little sheep face. Yeah, here, look at that. And then just wait, wait for oh, it, wait for it. I'm not done. There's and so then on many. A different one. Ah, it's stuck together. Look at this one. I really Ready? like these. It's a little sheep butt. Oh, wait, let me move my face. Oh, sorry. Oh, a little sheep butt. 
The sheet but hearts the in sheet the way. Butt. Anyways, it's a little sheet And butt. then I saw this one and I just had to like, look at this one. This is what we're all ready for, you guys. Oh yeah, that's, here's another one of those. Move your head for a sec. Oh, campfire. Oh, it's camping. Look at the little. Yeah. I got this so one you too. guys have to, okay, here she is. Here's your name. I'm going to hold it up and you guys are going to go to Instagram or Etsy. Wait a minute. Why isn't it loading? Why Did isn't you it? touch the screen? No, I didn't touch the screen. Oh, was my face in it still? No. Okay, cover mom's face. There it is. Okay. Burlap handmade. <laughs> one more thing here. Here it is. There she is. And Julie, then these little buttons. These are so stinking cute. She sent some little extra goodies. Little sheet buttons. And I'm like, okay, what are these? All purpose paper fabric. Oh. The tags? Fill me in. Fill me in, Julie. Paper, all purpose fabric. They're really sweet. I see. If they're like to label. Label what? I don't know. Like if you have a basket of stuff, you could put that on the basket. Yeah. All purpose. There's got to be an actual all purpose and paper. I'm thinking there's you know a what? It, I bet you that's, you know, if you have containers that, yeah. And you just dangle these down, tie them on. Maybe. Yeah. Oh, that's very cool. Oh, I thought she maybe added that for the, she put it on the note maybe, but anyway, Julie, we're apparently don't know what those are, <laughs> but they're very sweet. <laughs> they are. And this is like, I am keeping this. Oh, do it. she did send some things for giveaways. I don't have a, I don't have a, sets. I don't have a needle gauge. Can I keep this? Can I keep it? You can keep that. Oh, I don't have a needle gauge though. That, but is it that too. pretty? It's really actually, nice. I think it's wood. That's really know. sharp. It's beautiful. But that's I really so like nice. it. Awesome. Awesome. Awesome stuff. So that was actual fun mail and dirty socks. So I got the better mail out of the two. Yeah, of us. you did. Hey, I like those socks. So they fit my feet nice. Yeah. So, I mean, that's good mail for me. I'm glad you got them back. Okay, Sarah, where are we going? What's happening? Do you okay. want to talk about what you've been working on? Do we want to show all yeah. these? Let's, okay, so I got my new design started. Whoop, whoop. New design. So this is all going to be all new designs here today. was out of, oh shoot, now I'm forgetting what she called this color, these colorways. Um, Yarny? No, it had to do with rocks or something. <clears throat> yeah, okay, so this is a DK four color, I mean, not really fade, but I'm working it as a fade. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Um, it's so nice. I've this got is my colors backwards. But... By yarn ink. So I'll hold it while you get your design out. So I've started and this is going to be, well, it's not going to be. <gasps> Sorry. That, that it scared me. Fall into her cup of coffee. So I would. That I scared should... me. That, should... that would have fallen into the dip if I hadn't have taken the dip away. I shouldn't be allowed to be doing things. Um, in my brain, I'm calling this BFL 2.0. Um, ah. That's not what it's called, but nope. it's just um, going to be similar, similar. shape. And... I really liked how I reverse faded that. Yeah. So and this is, is DK, here. where the BFL is fingering. Yeah. And then different lace pattern. So you can see where it's faded from the more beige to the to the more. Oh, gray. I love it, and I love right this. There. Sarah said this is a simple lace that I could do. Yeah, it's an eight, yeah eight row repeat. Could I do it at a retreat? I said. I said, could I do it sitting at a retreat knitting? And I said, you'd screw up minor, minor screw ups. Yeah, for sure. I, I, I need to straighten it. Yeah. Anyway. The only problem with this style is that I have a random decrease um, along my increases. Every fourth increase. Oh yeah, because the shape of it, it's like an asymmetrical that yeah. bends. Yeah. Every, I like that shape though. Every fourth right side row, yeah. for the most part, is a increase and a decrease. So it doesn't add a stitch at all. Right. It just helps to bend but it. But it just bends it. Yeah. No, that's really nice. So this will be a big, cozy DK shawl. Yeah, that's big, cozy, be asymmetrical. Really nice. I'm excited for it. I really liked knitting that one. Yeah. Um, and that one I kind of speed knit through because I had a deadline on that one. Yeah, that was BFL. We called it Besties for Life, where that's one of our patterns. You can look up. It's fun because it's a four skein. You take four skeins of fingering and then split it with a friend. Split each one in 50 grams and then you can each knit Best friend shawls. Yep, and so you could reverse the colors from each other. So your yep. small side is one color ending with your fourth color. Yeah. And then your friend could start with the fourth color as one and, and whatever. Yeah, it was a fun, uh, a yep. fun, fun friend one. Yeah. Find a bestie and make a shawl with them. This will be the same idea, but at a DK, right? Yep. And not splitting the skeins. I'm using. Yeah, that's every, right. I'm using. So everything. it really isn't the same. Same, not the same. <laughs> Almost the same, but completely different. Yeah. So that's my work knitting. Okay, well, I'll, I'll do my work knitting. Okay. Okay, it's been a while. So it's been a while since we talked about it, but we're headed to the Hippie Strings Retreat at the beginning of May, and I think there's still room. 
Yeah, I think so. So if you are interested in coming to Jasper, we would love to see you. Get a hold of the Hippie Strings ladies, Robin and Cheryl, <coughs> and find out. Um, yeah, I'm I'm Probably certain dates. that I'm certain that there's still room. Yeah. So here's I what we're doing. Those. Those I've got way. I've got two designs going. So <coughs> the first one is for Actually, if you follow the wool baron, she just put this out. It's probably gone now in her shop. What's I think she'll called? do more. What's color we called? I, I have to look it up. I just love that one. I'm excited to see it. I am that. about to cast, like, as soon as I'm done these mittens, this mm -hmm. is going on. So what Sarah's wearing, I'll show you here. Do you want to put the toque on too? Sure. This is the beanie style. I'm going to do a, sl a slouchier version with this colorway. This is self-striping DK. <laughs> Sarah. Okay, I wear toques every put day. Put a hat on. There you go. So this oh, like stripes oh, itself, yeah. and then I've gone ahead and popped in some color work yeah. um, with the contrast gain. So that one has the gray. So that is just a super simple um, DK hat with some fun little color work charts that you can pop in. And then we've done that with the fingerless mitts. Yeah. Because of course it stripes up thicker, so you could pick what colors you want, you know, what's left of your skein. But this pretty much used up um, like a whole skein of the, well, except I had a, had a, had a oopsie. This not is my, oopsie, not an oopsie. I just wanted all the colors. So my first fingerless mitt was like super long, so, not fingerless. And you have long fingers. I do have long fingers. And I could pull it down. I was like, oh yeah, that'll be fine. Then I started wearing it around. I'm like, no, Sarah's like, that's way too long. And you're right. It is. Too yeah. Long. You need it to like, so I could only show joint on your pinky yeah, I as tall only, as you can go. I was bummed because I wanted to show more of the colors in the mitt. Yeah. But four colors in the mitt. Which but you at least get all the colors in the hat. Oh yeah. It's so If fun. you make the pair, like the match. And depending on where you start this game, you could showcase different colors. So then this will go on next. And then she's bringing this, um, these are colorways she's bringing to the retreat, but she's also got them listed on her, on her site. So that's Perfect. the wool baron on Instagram. And she's got great yarn. So this is going on next. So that's one pattern down for that. And then, of course, there's uh, Robin of Rose Hill is coming. And so we wanted to have a design, a toucan mitts that was kind of mountainy, that reminded us of the mountains. And that's really good for like DK. That, that's my slouchy version. Oh, put it on properly. No, I didn't actually I know, just mean kidding. to do that. That I just needs a on my glasses. That one just. Oh, that's super It just cute. needs a pom pom. Yeah. So there's slouchy and non slouchy. This is going to be good for just like. Okay, I like this. Solid is this for me. Do you love that color? I I do. Does it look weird with my hair? No, it like that color looks great with purple. I just I love this hat. It's okay, well. it fits really good. Okay, that was my third and final attempt. Yeah. I had a couple that were like this is not the, quite. This is the perfect fit. I know because it's tighter here. Yeah. But it's sl slouchier on the top. Yeah. I love it. And you I can do it. that same without the slouch. I'm, I'm writing in some shorter, like a shorter beanie decrease and then a longer. So this will be good for like your DK variegated. Yeah. Robin does beautiful variegated yarn. She does yeah. beautiful speckles and solids, tonals. Her color. Really doesn't matter. Her colors are just... I, her They're eye so for nice. color is, yeah. I feel like the phone is tilted back yeah. really far, oh, and that we're be. like sitting really short. Should we move it? Um, I'll just sit up. I won't slouch. You're just short. You're just seeing the top the of twins, our heads this today. This is how the twins feel. <laughs> <laughs> King Chris is I'm allowed you know? to say that. They're short. They are short. Um, okay. However, because we're in Grand Prairie and I needed yarn, like. ASAP, ASAP, of course, I could not help but go down and grab some of that yarn habit. If you love this color, I this is called Sea Glass. And this is by Tara of that yarn habit. She's local in Grand Prairie, or you can just order from her. This is her Tweety DK. You need it. Yeah. You 100% need it. So now I'm just working on the mittens. So try that out. I think I might need to up the needle size in the hand. But I'm just finishing up the mitten pattern. And then that's done. So I have two yeah, patterns. It, already, it pulls too much. Okay. I mean, I wondered, but I can do the second one on a 4.5. No one will know the difference, right? No. Yeah. No. Yeah. Yeah. It pulls too much. You lose the, the I mocha know. look. I knew I should have just done it, but I was like, oh, I kind of like my mittens a little, but Snugger. this is just fine. Yeah. A 4.5 would be fine. So I'll just up that for my next oh, one. Put that in your I'm not coffee. ripping it out because that's not what I do, but here Why is. Why not? You're barely. No. Pull back to the no, cuff. I'm not doing that. I'm not doing it again. I have other things I want to get done. I really want to cast this on. I'm dying to cast this self stripe because that oh, flew off my needles. It, 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 sorry, guys. It's driving me crazy. It's driving me crazy. Now the whole thing's there. Fall forward. No, you unhook it at the top. Okay. That's much better. Sketchy. It's when you clean my lens. I bet you. Oh, baby. 
yeah, I had to do that. So, so watch for these new patterns. They will be coming. Well, May, they'll be going first weekend of May to the retreat. And then after that, we will re release them mm -hmm. to the wild. I just to had a funny recipe. story in my head now. And now I can't remember. Okay, oh, well, we were talking about. I'm going to bring this next week. And I just popped into my head right now. So, cause we're, uh, we have one of our testers, um, working very closely with me of going through the world pattern because I had some funny things, whatever. Yes. Anyways. So we were working out this certain problem and I already had like, okay, so I have my full one done and then I have my purple one and I'm sitting there waiting and I'm going to keep that one where it is. And then with this other issue and I was like, oh, I don't want to rip back the 13 rows, which is double that because I'm going back and forth anyway. So I, I had this had other like little mini of swatch stitches. of just like janky yarn. Well, it's not janky. It's just scraps of yeah, yarn. Yeah. And uh, so I had like a little bit done, but I had to get to a point. <laughs> I've seen that. Right Sorry, on the sweater. I dripped it. Well, just rub it in. It looks like a speckle. Continue. <laughs> so. I'm so sloppy. And I had to get to 300 and blah stitches. So I just like, I have this little semicircle and then I have this long string of the rest I just thumb cast them on oh my god and worked back just to get to the stitch count and then I did my first row so that I'm gonna janky. bring it like but it's so funny I have so many janky little swatches like yes, that, that well, I I mean I was like well I'm not ripping that other one out because no. I want it to be no. where it is I was like what can I do I was like oh I have that other swatch on I'll just thumb cast on and put my markers where they need to go well, numbers smart. wise it's smart it's yeah way less because then I was like oh I could just cast a whole new one on at that stitch count. And I'm like, well, I have this like already 60, well, it's only 60 stitches really at, at 300 and some odd stitches. Really, I could have just cast it, but it's, it will just be funny. It will be funny. I'd like to see it like this. And then I'm like, going to bring it. Like this it's, long and I've done it so many times with so many of my designs. I'm like, <sighs> oh yeah, okay. I should show this. Like this is part of my process. <laughs> it, it is. It is part of your process. Yeah. So, um, I know we have a new cast on and some new yarn. Mm -hmm. I wonder, mom, do you, do you have a second? Yes. Do you want to bop down and ask Kiri if she wants to come up and show her blanket? Yes. Um, we'll see if we can convince my daughter to come up here and show you what she has casted on. And then I'll just quickly, for accountability, I just want to say that I have been working a little bit on my husband's sweater. Keep accountable. I'm just going to show. We've been kind of busy with, with work. Oh, oh, yeah, you're getting there. I'm like this far down the body. Oh, totally. So my goal is to have the body done before we go to Jasper. Yeah. And then just be working on the sleeves at the retreat. Yeah, that's perfect. I think that's, and then the next weekend is his birthday. Well, actually like three days later. Did we convince her to come up? Yeah. Why did we give her a choice? She yeah. just said come up and show Can you grab it? Do you want to grab your blanket? You can pop in between Nancy and I. So this is Kiri and she started, I don't know if you've seen this yet. Comes at, I've seen a part of it. Sit, sit right down. here. Say hello. Hello. <laughs> okay, let's see it. I am excited about this. This, is for, this is for me, right? Mm. <laughs> look, it's, it's for me, right? Kiri. You can say, look at Do you want to tell what it is? No. Do you want to say what? Are you knitting or crocheting? Crochet. Crochet. <laughs> okay, so she started a blanket. It's like that super soft. Can what do you just call feel this? it? Look at that. You can like feel, you can see it and you can just know that it's so it soft. Feels yeah, so soft. Yeah. And so we're going to get some more. This is one ball of each. So what color, other colors do you think you want to put in? You want to add some different colors? I think a bright green and bright yellow would look good. Especially, yeah, it'd be no. festive for Maybe Easter. Purple. purple or white, I think you were looking at. Oh, yeah, that'll know. work. You want to keep it as blue and pink and just stripe it or go see what's there? She doesn't talk as much as our mommy. <laughs> <laughs> or her auntie or her nana. She, she is not like... Her mommy and her aunties. <laughs> she will be. Yeah. She oh, but be. she will be. Can't stop us from talking. We couldn't get you to speak two, That's words, true. two words together That's until, you true. Were, until you went on your first houseboat trip with your Auntie Bernie. And then she came back. She just came back. Nonstop. I came back drinking coffee. Yeah. Apparently, yeah. that's what did it. And Which is fine. I couldn't shut her up. Yeah. And I'm, I said to my She's sister, I said, okay, you can go. Melt what away. do you, you can go? go. <laughs> Yeah, and then all of a sudden I was speaking and oh, Kiri, you're so cute. everything. I think she's gonna do some more stripes and then put a border. I, I think still we're think gonna that put a border on it, right? You should make it for me and give it to Sarah. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> oh, anyway. Okay, goodbye. We're out shopping. She's like, anyway. I, I, she wanted the yarn. I said, well, no. And then I said, well, listen. If I buy you a few skeins, I have to promise that you'll come and show it on the podcast. Oh yeah. 
she was not impressed. Whereas, like, my son, who has his own YouTube channel, is oh, like, yeah. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And he's like his mother. You can't stop him from talking. Yeah. Him. His little videos mother. are cute. But when Carrie gets going, she, she yeah. has, but she's super shy. Okay. Let's talk about our new yarn. Okay. Let's show it. Well, and show your. Yeah, but you can. This is what we is got this in. Is a surprise? Did you do so much and you're not telling me? No, I haven't picked it oh, up okay, since okay. midnight. Okay, talk it's about it. It's going to be like my sock, like my midnight sock. Okay, so we all knit the Autumn League pullover. Yes, if you've been around for any amount of That's time, you know big. that we've all knit this. Mom's knit two of them. And so promptly after that last podcast two weeks ago, um, we ordered the black finally. Because when we originally ordered, they didn't have this color in. It was sold out. Now look at, are these that different or is the light different? Just let me turn them around over here. Oh, it's just the light. Just the light. Oh, yeah. So this is the Cotton Jeans by Lion Brand. And when we, yeah, when we originally looked at doing the sweater, Autumn League Pullover, you can look that up. This is what the designer used. Yeah. We really wanted this color, but it wasn't in. So I got, Katie and I got navy. This Mom, is all I have done. Yeah. Mom and Sarah got gray. Yeah. Like the lighter gray. The lighter gray, yeah. I and love then, black too. I'm super and you know excited what? about I this. Have, that's, that sweater knit out of that cotton is fabulous. Well, that's it's the so thing. Perfect. It, it, it's for so us to order another sweater quantity yeah and gonna knit the same sweater each, a sweater quantity each that tells you a lot was it wasn't included yeah. in the each they obviously you've already knit two. Two. well i can always knit a third that is true we could order you some of them yeah um we i think because i love the knit and but it's then something I totally about this forgotten cotton how i how it knit up because i did not remember that it's not joined right away no, there's a lot of things about this. Now, we did hack a little bit, but told Sarah, follow the instructions and it'll work out. Well, the part that really got me was that little X. Yeah. I took yeah. that out three times before I realized that it's supposed to be, a, one end is supposed to be <laughs> One end shorter than the other. Oh, I was yeah. so frustrated with that. You could just go ahead and do another round and, and well, even no, it out. But that's I, how the design is. I like yeah, it with that little I, long little line. It makes it look Perfect. Like, yeah. you know, it's, it's kind of cool. It's very so cool. what happened is, so I think, I think the, our last podcast is when we had all our special guests, right? We had Byrne and Joanne. Yep. Yeah. Yep. I'm pretty sure I'm wearing my blue one. Promptly after that podcast was over, my auntie Byrne tried it on and it went home and, with her. Oh yeah. It's gone now. So it's gone, which is my justification for casting on. I haven't cast it on. And I wear the crap out of my gray one is my justification. I want, and I want mine to fit like Sarah's. It was a little too short. I love the blue one, yeah. but it was literally Auntie Byrne put it on. Yeah. It it's perfect. like I, yeah, knit, I couldn't have knit it for her so better. It was, a bit, it, would, it, it was perfect it for was her. It was perfect for her. Because she likes that wide. It was so perfect it had on the her. Wide, wider neck yeah. line than yeah. mine was. Yeah. Yours was up higher, and I like how your gray one fit me. I tried yeah. to steal it that day. Yeah. So I'm going to try for getting one to fit. Just I still like have to wash one. mine. Did we get any comments about that? Yeah, they said just wash it and not dry it. I would just ha I would just hand wash it and lay it out to dry, and then I would stick it in the dryer, the dryer at the like end, five just... minutes before it's okay. Dry. I think Fluff I'll have to do that because I mean I wear that the you most. Wear it Actually, all the I need time. The, I need to re or rewash this one. I know, but it's nice because it's not wooly wooly, and so you can wear it in this like it's perfect. I know. Yeah, I think it'll be a great summer spring for yeah. those chillier days. Because yeah. when did we knit them? I really want it. But I can't well, cast on. I knit mine when it was yet. 40 above. That was my 40 above knit because I was, and I was out done of the farm that week, that whole week. And with I the was cotton? Down, I was in the basement because I couldn't. It was so hot. True that. Did week. I finish mine I before could, you or did you finish yours first? Oh, I can't remember. So anyways, mine you was You guys were last, pretty close last though. Last summer. Okay. So I think mom finished hers first because she already <laughs> had cast on and done a second one too. Right. Yeah. And then I just finished mine like a month ago. But mine was probably in and around that heat yeah. wave too that I was knitting it. Yeah. And then Katie gave hers to Christy and I gave mine to Burn. That's so funny. And Not because we didn't love them. It's I just, refuse to give mine away. No, light. your gray one is perfect. This black one will be exactly what I yeah, want. Yeah, my gray one. Yeah. I won't. That's mine. And I yeah. wear the crap out of it. Yeah. So there you go. Autumn Link Pullover. Get yourself some cotton jeans. Right from Lion Brand is where we ordered it. And it was very quick. I was shocked how fast it came in from yeah. the States. So super quick. And had we podcasted, it would have been there for podcast. Because yeah. did, did, no, oh, it came Thursday. It came Thursday. It came Thursday. So that worked out perfect. Because then so I brought hoping, it to you at night and that's where I cast on. Who knows? Off. Maybe I'll bring it to the retreat and then if I want to cast on something new. Because it's an easy knit. It really is. It's an easy knit. Jamie, you want to cast there. this on there? It's too dark. No, it's too confusing. Oh, at first. Yeah, there's too much to look at. I'll be knitting Corey's sweater. I'll, I'll, I'll be knitting Corey's sweater. Maybe I'll cast it on before that. No, what I want to get back to is my is my blanket. 
Yep. I really want to pick that back up, but I've been working. So anyway, yep. quick JoJo update. Yep. Is that where we're at? That's where I'm at. I got nothing Hey, else. Mom. Yeah, I've got a few bags Talk to us. the shop. Um, yeah, just the... I just love that fabric. Oh, I, I love it. I just love oh, that fabric. It's but such a great this spring. This is pretty much the end of it. I might get a couple more bags yeah. out of that, but... Yep. So we've got a couple we'll drawstrings in there, which has that same sort of inner pocket, yep. um, notions pouch pocket, really nice. So two drawstrings are in there currently. Well, they will be. Um, <laughs> and then four Probably large then. zipped. Oh no, three. Yep. A brown and two purple. Oh, this is just like, oh, I like that brown, how it pulls the pine cone. Oh, yeah, I it love, really yeah. does. I love how the purple pulls all these. It yeah. almost looks like different, like if you're just looking Ooh. at them quick. You probably need two of them. Just get one of each and then you'll be good. <laughs> <laughs> so there you go. Jojo bag. Um, and you always have the link where? In, in the, the description, description box below. There you go, Jojo. Thank you. I think that is it. That's it. I think we got to go and snack a little more. Yeah, I'm ready. And I'll, uh, I will try to hone my, I'll try again. I think your next batch I know what I should did. be pretty bang on. I know my, well, I think there's so much you can, it takes a long time to perfect it, I do believe, but I think right. I could get a decent one next time. I know I put way too much flour in. Uh, so are I you going to do another one soon? Yeah. Like today. Oh, I've got to have um, It's like keep it in your brain, I would take right? it what out. you did wrong to change instead yeah. of going like, oh, did I need to add another cup of flour? No, Did no. I have too little? No, I'll probably, who knows? So nice. I'll see what tomorrow has in store, but I'll take it out tonight. I think I need to have these. They Do you love those? fit perfect. They're the nicest ones okay. I've ever, ever had. Well, once they're photographed and, and I'm done with the pattern. And these will just be so nice on my arthritic knuckles. Oh, my arthritic <laughs> Are you sure you don't like this length? The I super like, long I do. one? Do you have another one that okay. matches? No, I don't have enough yarn. Oh, okay. no, this is my prototype. This, oh, is too, okay. this one's too long, Mom. This one's too long. Oh, yeah, it covers like right to yeah, the tips it went, of your I, oh, I did okay. one color too many, so I yeah. just cut it off here. No, this is perfect. But I wasn't ripping it out. I thought, well, I'll see if I have oh, enough. Beautiful. beautiful. You know what? Beautiful. I could make another one from the other yarn. And have I could have a, a mismatch. Because I don't care if it's too long. I'll just fold it down. Yeah, exactly. There you go. There you go. I'll just make a mis mix matched. Mis Mixed matched. and matched. What? Mismatched? That'll drive me crazy. Match? And you could do like a gray bottom beige top. I could. Gray bottom beige top. Well, I've already done the mm. top. Don't worry. I don't rip out. Right, right, right. Okay. That is it, That's folks. Fine. That's it. That's all. We'll see you next time. Happy, Happy New Year's. Year's.